Hello, welcome to Switched On. Paul here, and today I've got an update video for you on the Nintendo Switch version of Snooker 19, which has been out uh, a week or so now, a couple of weeks. Um, it was patched today to sort of bring it into parity with the other console versions, which is great news. I've got the patch notes here, and uh, we're going to have a look at those and also have a little look at some of the new gameplay features. If I just give you the patch notes first, this is actually patch 1.0.4 on the Switch and on the other versions, consoles and PC is 1.12. But um, some of the things it's enabled, a big one is straight off the bat for the Switch. And it's going to have cross-platform play between the Switch and the PC versions of the game. Uh, it would be really, really, really nice to include the Xbox versions as well. I don't know if that's planned. I'm going to reach out to Lab42 and see if that is the case. But for now, just to have cross-play with PC version is going to be massive because... You know, to be honest, the, the Switch player base isn't the biggest. So the fact we're going to have a you know a, a whole pool of online players dumped in to play against is just going to be amazing. So big thanks to Lab42 for adding that in. Um, improvements and fixes for the shootout version, including penalty notices, commentary and ball in hand shot timer. All very nice. Commentary improvements, looking forward to some of those. Not heard any myself yet, uh, but certainly be keeping an ear out for those. Improvement to the career mode intros and outro scenes. So again, quite interested to hear what that is, whether that's going to be stuff like walk-ons, not quite sure. Um, career mode schedule screen will now show correct tournament results. Obviously a little bug fix there, that's nice. At the start of the match, you can no longer position the cue ball in front of the brown ball. Obviously a big, um, big bug there that's been fixed. And then um, also some general bug fixes, crash fixes and improvements. Also, one of the things that has been added specifically to the Switch version, um, which is massive again for uh, players that have got it on the Switch and, uh, and have been enjoying this game, and that's we've now got all the cutscenes that the other console versions have got. So like the cinematic cutscenes when taking a shot, we, we were very limited on those before. Game was still fine without them, but you know to have those different angles in when you're taking a shot improves the game massively. I've had a, a, a quick frame this morning and uh, it makes a massive difference just to get some of those really nice dynamic camera angles from different positions uh, makes the matches far more interesting and enjoyable to watch. Um, so there is that as well. Also on the Switch version, there was something else as well. It might have been the Master Plus. Oh, there it is, yeah. The Master Plus aiming is now enabled as well. So we really are sort of on parity with all the other versions, which is brilliant for the Switch version. We're bang up to date with the uh, the same version that all the other guys have got. Oh, also the chalking animations as well, I think, are in. So between shots, you may see the players chalking their cue, which wasn't in before. So another nice one to have there. Um, I'm not going to play on Master Plus. I am pretty terrible at this game. I'll go on Pro Plus is about the best that I'll, um, I'll brave. But we'll get into some gameplay, just have a look at some of those new camera angles, see if we can spot any of the new commentary lines, and uh, see if we can see those chalking animations as well. The whole, you know, the whole package, this whole patch update, really good news for Switch owners of the game. That um, A, we had to wait so long for the for the Switch version to come out. When it did, obviously very impressive. Gave it a good review, gave it an 8.5 out of 10. And the reason the score wasn't slightly higher was due to some of these emissions and little bugs. So, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Great to see them in now. Frame, should Trump to break. So, going with Trump, you should be able to see one of the new uh, additions straight away. As you see, uh, Trump get down. There you go, with his demon eyes. Little bug I've spotted straight away here. Look at the uh, the D in the bulk line now as the ball goes past it. Some weird graphics on the uh, on the D there. Hopefully, they can be patched out because that looks a bit. Bit ropey, but let's just pot a few balls. I won't play a whole frame. That's not the point of uh, this video. But you see there, another nice camera angle. Great opening there. One. Just pot a few balls and just see what we can uh, what we can spot that's new. So again, another nice angle. In she goes. Not left that herself on any red. At all. So that's not ideal. Eight. Also, while I'm uh, playing this, I also want to mention uh, Snooker Club Live. I'll leave a link 
down in my description. I'm not affiliated with those guys in any way at all, apart from the fact I enjoy what they're doing, but they actually run um, some online competitions using Snooker 19, and the fact that the Switch will now cross-play with PC means that we're going to have more options there for... Uh, He's handed his opponent a real opportunity for the seasons as they come along. So check that out. I'll leave a link to their Discord and their website down below. So if you do enjoy Snooker 19 and you're looking for more people to play against, maybe a bit more competitively, then check that out. One. Nice bunch of lads. There we see Judd Trump going for the chalk. I'm just going to have a quick look the next time a shot's taken here because one of the things that the Switch version was missing as well was shadows underneath the queue. They were kind of omitted, so I'm just going to have a... I haven't spotted it yet, but I haven't been looking for it. Not really shadow under the queue. There's some shadows under the finger fingertips of Judd Trump now. Excellent. A lot more. Seems to be a lot more um, crowd interaction as well. Just keeping an eye on the... Shot time, it's taken the AI to take the shot as well because that was one of my complaints. Is that um, the, the AI took a lot of time? You get that sort of spinning uh, rack of balls shot. at the top of the screen while the AI thinks. 17. I may have to speed this up actually because, um, oh, I was gonna say Judd Trump's not gonna Judd Trump. miss, but he's obviously not got anything on. So, yeah, again, seems to be a lot more crowd interaction, a lot more uh, applause from the crowd, which is awesome. Again, not really got much on here. Going to have to play a little safety. And then, honestly, we're going to finish this video up pretty soon. Um, just wanted to play a little bit more just to see if we can spot anything else that's new. But, I mean, I'm really happy with this patch. That's a terrible shot. Um, just having those new cinematic angles is just a, a big plus. It's going to make my career mode matches really a better watch as well. All that well. You see Ronnie sitting in the background now. Judd plays another safety. It's left us one onto the middle pocket, is he? Ooh, that'd be the finest of cuts. I don't think we can uh don't think we can get that, but we can certainly get that long red down to the bottom. Give that a slam. Let's see if we, if we put it on full power, see if we've got any different um ball noises. So, or certainly into the pocket noises. Go hundred percent power. We're not gonna be able to spin back here, so we're probably gonna end up in the pocket. No, it wasn't really any sort of discernible Decent position to take on a colour here. noise of the of the ball slamming into the pocket there. So we'll end this video. Thanks for watching. I um, hope these uh, improvements make your enjoyment of Snooker 19 even greater. Um, yeah, so please subscribe, like this video, and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.